At the other end of my universe, far away across oceans of time, up and over Muffle Mountain and hidden deep in a valley, is my hometown, Shining Time. Every now and then, there appears a sign that points just round the bend to a place you'll find covered in clover. The magic comes over you, showing up right on time. This is your shining time. Climbing through stars to your own cloud nine Soft strokes of lightning Paint the skies brightening Up on your shining time And by the way, I think that you're going to help me and Thomas somewhere in this story. If Diesel has unfinished business, there's sure to be trouble right around the corner. You weren't concentrating, Thomas. Lucky for you that the buffers were there. That's what buffers are for, to stop engines from crashing. What are you doing in the sheds, James? I'm feeling a little blue, which isn't so hot when you're red. I was naughty and Sir Topham Hatt told me to think about all the ways I can be really useful. Then I can come out again. He's just trying to make this a better railway for steam engines. So uh, Topham Hatt Lois. says, the harder we work, the less he'll need diesels to help. Help you? Oh. <laughs> oh. You'll always need help. Because steam engines are cowardly, cranky, worn-out hunks of metal who couldn't hurt a fly. No, we're not. Yes, you are. Aren't. Are. Now, I've come back to find a lost steam engine. What? I'm gonna destroy her and dominate you. And then you'll be nothing but useless scrap. Right, Pinchy? Big bully, stinker. <laughs> We're really useful engines. You won't dominate us, and you won't destroy her. We won't let you. Neither will Mr. Conductor. I'm off to fetch him now. What lost engine? <laughs> 